Let me welcome all of you as we are here today to bear witness to Michael and Maggie as they enter into the covenant of marriage. This is a day that you will remember for the rest of your lives. Uh, because although there's been millions of marriage ceremonies that have been performed from the, since the beginning of time, this is yours. Michael, freely and willingly take Maggie to be your wife, to love, honor, and cherish her, forsaking all others to live with her in the covenant of marriage established by God. If so, say, I do. I do. We could spend the year in France. I'd learn the things that make you laugh. Or oh, we could do so many things like that. I'd give you the moon and change the stars, most anything. Maggie, freely and willingly take Michael to be your husband, to love, honor, and respect him, forsaking all others to live with him in the covenant of marriage established by God, if so, say, I do. I do. When we were kids, Michael was always a great brother to me. Maggie, you look so beautiful today. We are so excited to welcome you into our family. You are smart, kind, and way too good for my brother. Today and always. In the presence of our family, friends, guardian angels, and the Lord our Savior, I commit to becoming one with you. As we continue our life together, I will embrace this journey of two imperfect people creating a wonderful story together, whether it be the way we intended or not. To you, I vow my love, commitment, and dedicated affection until the day I die, and promise to spend our living days well. I thank the Lord every day for giving me the person who loves me for who I am. I promise to do the same. I am yours, Maggie. I love you. Everywhere we go, we're asked if we're sisters, and sometimes even twins. It is a huge compliment to be compared to my sister, and I couldn't ask for a better person to be compared to. Michael, it has been a pleasure getting to know you over the years. I see the way you love Maggie so well, and I know you are her person through and through. You make her happy, you make her smile, your goofiness makes her laugh, and you're always there as a shoulder to cry on. this day forward, I commit my heart to you, loving who you are now and who you are yet to become. I vow to stand by your side through every triumph, every struggle, every dream, and every sorrow. I vow to love you, to respect you, to trust you, to encourage you, and to laugh with you all the days of my life. Michael, you're my very best friend and I can't wait to create a beautiful life together. I am so thankful God led me to you seven years ago. I loved you then. I love you now, and I will love you always. Maggie and Michael, I know you both are missing a huge piece of your heart today on this special day. Maggie, I know if Dad was here, he would tell you that you are the most beautiful bride he's ever seen. He would tell you both he's proud of you and wish you a long, happy life together. And then he would grab a bud from the bar and meet you on the dance floor for the Sandy Lake. It'll be nice to finally have a sister, and our family feels much more complete now that you are a part of it. Michael and Maggie, your relationship has shown us all how fun, loving, and supportive a relationship should be, and I can't wait to see what the future holds for the both of you.
Well, Michael and Maggie, you all have exchanged vows, you have exchanged rings. And so by the power vested in me, by the state of Missouri, and by God, I want to pronounce you as husband and wife. And Michael, you may kiss your bride.